with the Style One halters. Here we have one of the most basic halters. It's the Style One halter, and it is eight dollars. Um, this is just without any extras, as you can see. Now the Style One halter, it's made out of grosgrain ribbon, or if you want to, just the smooth ribbon. Um, it's all one price now, and of course the Style One has a real buckle. And it's really nice. Um, most people prefer this style compared to the second style. Um, however, like they're both really good, I have to admit. Um, it's just the difference is the buckle. So it's really, really nice. And it's going to be proven by a judge, hopefully sometime soon. Um, just so I can tell you guys what quality it is. But it is quite nice. I mean, I've tried some of my other tack and it's made LSQ before. So I'm sort of anxious to see what this will get. And I know some of you who have ordered from me in the past are really pleased, so yeah, that's the style one, but let's get into some of the extras here. Okay, so I've picked out some good examples of the extras that you can put on your style one or style two halters, but we'll get to style two in a minute. Um, this is a style one that has been um, added with um, plates on the side, and the plates can only come on the side, and it's couple cents extra. If you want to do your research, please go to my website at www.kingstonstudios.weebly.com. Link will be in the description, and you can also get rhinestones on your halter. Um, here we have some on the nose. If you want a bunch of rhinestones like such, it's one dollar, but um, any, like, if you just want them studded on the sides, you can also stud the platelets for 25 cents. Um, so it's really nice. I really like this halter. It's very unique. So that's just an example of some of the stuff that I can do with it. And also, we can also have nameplates on your halters as well. Okay, here's a good example of having names on the halters. You can put both their show name and their stable name, one on either side, or you can also have um, your actual stable name and the horse's name. However, the names can't really be that long, otherwise it would go off the sides. But here's an example. It says Daniel right here, and then on the other side, it says 21 guns. So that's sort of like a little example of what we can do, and I believe it's about 75 cents to add one name onto it. Um, please correct me if I'm wrong, it should be on my website. <laughs> I'm just too lazy to sort of go there and check that, but um, all prices are there. So now let's get to the Style 2 halters. Here's our example of a Style 2 halter. As you can see, it basically looks just like the first. However, the buckle is not an actual buckle at all. As you can see here, it's just two little rings right there. For those who are sort of on a budget, one dollar less budget, but still, it's saving a dollar. So. Um, but anyways, as you can see, it's really nice. It fits very well to any horse that you choose. If you prefer to have it fit to a certain mold, you can go ahead and tell me that. But, of course, this is $7. It's really nice, made with grain ribbon, or if you want, it can be made with regular smooth ribbon. And so, now on to our about-to-go-on-sale halters, the Style 3 halters. Okay, so here's our Style 3. It is currently not for sale, but it should be um, sometime in the future, I promise you that. And, of course, you can tell the difference. That is that there are halter slots and a buckle. So, it's really nice. Um, I'm telling you right now, they are not for sale yet. Yet, people. Yet. So, keep a lookout for those, and they're really nice, and the price would be about $10.00. Um, for they would most likely be LS of LSQ quality. So moving on to the bridles. All right, now here are the bridles. Bridles are ten dollars. They're made of grosgrain ribbon and they're quite nice. Um, now as you can see, it has the just the regular bit right here. Of course, we can make the bits larger or have a snaffle for only a small price extra. Um, they're quite lovely and they have um, three buckles as you can see um, I apologize for this one being way up here it's supposed to be right here but I made this one quite a long time ago so of course my style has gotten better since then <laughs> but um, still this is just sort of like a little look at what it looks like it's really nice I love these bridles to death 
And we have multiple colors, and we can also do by colors. So, for example, if you wanted this to be green and the sides to be pink and the reins to be pink, then it could be like that. But whatever, customize as you please. So those are the bridles. Now let's get on to the martingales. The martingales. Martingales are six dollars, and they're really nice. They can come in whatever color you wish, in grey grain or the smooth silk ribbon. Now. It has two adjustable parts, um, as you can see right here, and one exactly like that on the other side, so it can adjust to fit any horse. It's really nice. And then, of course, it has a place under here that connects to the girth. It also comes with a attachment for any girths that are different than briar, so, yeah. I just had to take that part off right here so it would fit him a little bit better. So... Yeah, it fits basically any traditional scale model. It's really nice. I enjoy these very much. But now since we've seen the martingales, let's move on to the Arabian Hollywood Showstyle Halters. Here's our Arabian Hollywood Showstyle Halter. Um, these are $14, and they're quite lovely. As you can see, it has the beads right here and the tassels that are handmade by me, of course. <laughs> and, of course, it has a real buckle right here and comes with a lead rope as you can see here however it would most likely be a lobster clasp rather than this so a little tippy aren't we today and of course you can just sort of give me the color of ribbon and I can basically match a bead pattern based on um, your gold or silver hardware because as you can see since I have gold hardware I have gold beads on here as well so it looks really nice this is one of the best ones that I've made, as you can see, it's quite lovely. And so, now that is all of the stuff that I currently have for sale. Um, remember, they are custom orders, so if there's anything that you want to be made to your specifications, I can do it. So, yeah, thanks for stopping by in the tax shop, and hope you'll purchase something from us soon.